Embarking on a journey is always thrilling, especially when the destination is as enthralling as Kazakhstan. Imagine, if you will, kicking off an 11-day adventure from the heart of Central Asia, Almaty, a city that is as vibrant as it is diverse, where modernity collides with tradition in the most beautiful of ways. Every street corner has a story to tell, every building a testament to the city's rich history and dynamic future. Now picture this, you're soaring above Almaty, the city sprawling below you like an intricate tapestry. The stunning aerial view is breathtaking, the patchwork of urban life and lush green parks blending seamlessly with the snow-capped peaks in the distance. It's a sight that promises an adventure like no other, a journey that will take you to the heart of Kazakhstan's culture, history, and people. But Almaty is just the beginning. Over the next 11 days, we'll be traversing the length and breadth of this captivating country. From the cultural heart of Almaty to the futuristic cityscape of Astana, the industrial might of Karaganda, and the lesser-known gems of Ust-Kamenogorsk, Atirau, and Taraz, this journey promises a kaleidoscope of experiences. Along the way, we'll uncover the soul of Kazakhstan, a country that is as diverse as it is vast. We'll immerse ourselves in its rich history, soak in its vibrant culture, and revel in its breathtaking landscapes. And through it all, we'll be accompanied by the infectious rhythms of upbeat, happy music that perfectly captures the spirit of our adventure. So, are you ready? Ready to embark on a journey that promises to be as educational as it is entertaining, as enlightening as it is exciting? A journey that will take you from the bustling streets of Almaty to the serene landscapes of Pavlodar. From the towering skyscrapers of Nur Sultan to the charming alleyways of Taraz, trust me, this is one adventure you don't want to miss. It's a trip that promises to be as dynamic and diverse as Kazakhstan itself, a journey that will leave you with memories to last a lifetime. So buckle up as we prepare to take off on this exhilarating journey from Almaty. Almaty, the cultural heart of Kazakhstan, is our first stop. Nestled at the foothills of the trans ili Alatau Mountains, Almaty is a city that has withstood the test of time and emerged as a vibrant cultural center. Almaty's history is as captivating as its picturesque setting. Once the capital of Kazakhstan, it has a rich tapestry of stories that date back to the Bronze Age. As we delve into its past, we find a city shaped by diverse influences from the Silk Road traders to the Russian Empire and the Soviet era. What makes Almaty truly stand out is its architecture. A walk through its streets is like flipping through a book of architectural styles. You'll find traditional Kazakh structures with their distinctive wooden carvings, stately Russian Orthodox cathedrals and Soviet-era buildings that are monuments to the ideals of their time. But Almaty isn't stuck in the past. It's a city that embraces the new, with modern skyscrapers reaching for the sky, their glass facades reflecting the city's ambition. Now, let's talk about food. The culinary scene in Almaty is a mouth-watering fusion of flavors. Traditional Kazakh dishes like beshbarmak and kurdak share the table with Russian, Korean, and Uyghur influences. The bustling green bazaars offer a feast for the senses with their array of spices, fruits, and local delicacies. And let's not forget the national drink kumis, fermented mare's milk that packs a punch, a must-try for the adventurous. Almaty is also a city of festivals. From the vibrant spring festival of Naris, which marks the start of the new year, to the Golden Autumn Harvest Festival, it's a city that loves to celebrate its traditions. But what truly makes Almaty special is its people. Warm, welcoming, and proud of their city, they are the beating heart of Almaty. Whether it's the skilled artisans keeping traditional crafts alive, the young entrepreneurs driving the city's creative scene, or the locals who'll invite you to share a meal, they embody the spirit of Almaty. Almaty, a city that perfectly blends tradition with modernity, leaves an indelible mark on our journey. Next, we head to Astana, a city that looks like it's straight out of a science fiction novel. This is not your typical ancient city filled with centuries-old cathedrals and cobblestone streets. No, Astana is a young, vibrant, and futuristic city, a testament to the rapid development of Kazakhstan. Astana, now known as Nur Sultan, is a city that has sprung up in the heart of the Kazakh steppe like a mirage, with a skyline that is as unique as it is breathtaking. It's a cityscape filled with glistening towers that reach for the sky and architectural marvels that defy gravity and imagination. One of the city's crown jewels is the Baterek Tower, a monument and observation tower that symbolizes a Kazakh legend. 
Its distinctive design, featuring a golden egg nested atop a tree of life, certainly sets it apart from the usual skyscrapers. Then there's the Palace of Peace and Reconciliation, a pyramid that stands as a symbol of unity and harmony, and the Khan Shadir Entertainment Center, a massive tent-shaped structure that houses an entire shopping and entertainment world inside. Astana's transformation from a small town into a bustling metropolis is a testament to Kazakhstan's vision and determination. It is a city that has embraced technology, innovation, and modernity, yet still holds on to its traditional roots. Astana, a city of the future, offers a fascinating insight into Kazakhstan's rapid development. It's a city that dares to dream big, and if its breathtaking skyline is any indication, its dreams are becoming reality. From the futuristic cityscape, we venture into the industrial powerhouse of Karaganda, a city that hums with the rhythm of machinery, the pulse of progress. Karaganda, situated in the heart of Kazakhstan, is a testament to the country's industrial prowess, a monument to human endeavor. This city, once a small mining village, has transformed itself over the decades into a key player in Kazakhstan's economy. It's a place where the past and the present coalesce, where the echoes of pickaxes striking rock blend seamlessly with the hum of modern machinery. Imagine this. It was in the early 20th century when coal was first discovered in these parts. Since then, Karaganda has been synonymous with mining, its veins rich with black gold. Today, it is one of the largest coal mining regions in the world, an industrial behemoth that contributes significantly to the nation's economy. But it's not just about coal. Karaganda's industrial sector is diverse and vibrant. From metallurgy to machinery manufacturing, the city is a hub of innovation and enterprise. It's a place where ideas are forged into reality, where dreams of progress are made tangible. Yet amid the steel and smoke, Karaganda has not lost its soul. Its people, resilient and hardworking, are the true driving force behind its industrial success. Their spirit, their tenacity, is the lifeblood that fuels this city's relentless march towards a prosperous future. Karaganda, with its rich industrial history, adds a unique dimension to our journey. As we move further into Kazakhstan, we stumble upon the hidden gems of Ust Kamenogorsk, Atirao, and Taraz. First, let's talk about Ust Kamenogorsk. Nestled in the eastern part of Kazakhstan near the borders with Russia and China, this city is a delightful blend of cultures. Known for its stunning architecture, Ust Kamenogorsk has numerous historical buildings, each with a unique story to tell. The city is also a haven for nature lovers. With the Irtysh and Olba rivers flowing through, it's a picture-perfect spectacle. Now let's move on to Atirao. Situated on the border of Europe and Asia, Atirao is a city where two continents meet, and it's as fascinating as it sounds. The city is a hub of oil and gas industry, but it's not just about the black gold. Atirao is also a city of history and culture. The Imangali Mosque, for instance, is a testament to the Islamic architecture, while the Atirao Bridge, one of the longest in Kazakhstan, is a modern marvel. And then there's Taraz, one of the oldest cities in Kazakhstan. Taraz has a history that stretches back over 2,000 years. It was an important stop on the Silk Road, and you can still feel the echoes of the past in its ancient mausoleums and archaeological sites. But Taraz is not stuck in the past. The city is a vibrant mix of old and new where cosmopolitan cafes and bustling markets coexist with historic monuments. Each of these cities has a unique charm, but they all share a common trait, their natural beauty. In Ust Kamenogorsk, it's the pristine rivers and lush green landscapes. In Atirao, it's the enchanting Caspian Sea and the endless steppe. And in Taraz, it's the majestic mountains and tranquil parks. These natural wonders are a testament to Kazakhstan's diverse geography and are a big part of what makes these cities such hidden gems. But it's not just about the sites, it's also about the people. The locals in these cities are known for their hospitality and friendliness. They are proud of their heritage and are always eager to share their culture with visitors. So whether you're sampling local cuisine, learning about local traditions, or simply chatting with the locals, you're sure to have a memorable experience. And let's not forget the festivals. From the colorful Noris celebration in spring to the vibrant Kazakh New Year, these cities know how to throw a party. These festivals are a great way to immerse yourself in local culture and traditions, and they're a lot of fun too. In short, Ust Kamenogorsk, Atirao, and Taraz may not be as well known as some of the other cities in Kazakhstan, but they are definitely worth a visit. 
Each city has its own unique attractions, rich history, and natural beauty. And the best part? They are still relatively untouched by mass tourism, so you can enjoy a more authentic and peaceful experience. Ustkamenogorsk, Atirau, and Taraz, though lesser known, have left us with unforgettable memories. As our journey nears its end, we arrive in Nur Sultan, the capital city of Kazakhstan. This pulsating city is the heart of the nation, a place where politics, economics, and culture converge to create a unique and vibrant tapestry. Nur Sultan was declared the capital in 1997, a move that marked a significant milestone in the country's post-independence history. Since then, it has emerged as the political nerve center of Kazakhstan, housing the presidential palace, the parliament house, and numerous other government offices. It's here that the decisions shaping the future of Kazakhstan are made. But Nur Sultan isn't just about politics. It's also the economic powerhouse of the country. Its skyline, punctuated by gleaming skyscrapers, is a testament to the city's rapid economic growth. It's home to many multinational corporations and has become an attractive destination for investors from around the world. These economic strides are mirrored in the city's bustling streets where traditional bazaars rub shoulders with modern shopping malls. Yet, amidst this modernity, Nur Sultan hasn't lost touch with its cultural roots. The city is a melting pot of Kazakh traditions and global influences. Its cultural landscape is as diverse as its people, with landmarks like the Astana Opera and the Palace of Peace and Reconciliation offering glimpses into the city's rich cultural life. And then there's the city's impressive skyline. It's dominated by the Baidarek Tower, a monument that's come to symbolize Nur Sultan. The tower, with its golden sphere and tall, slender structure, is an architectural marvel that perfectly encapsulates the city's ambition and spirit. But Nur Sultan isn't just about grandeur, it's also a city of parks and public spaces, where locals and visitors alike can escape the hustle and bustle and enjoy a moment of tranquility. It's a city that knows how to balance progress with preservation, modernity with tradition. Nur Sultan, a city that embodies the spirit of Kazakhstan, has left us in awe. Our final stop is Pavlodar, a city that offers a blend of the old and new. Situated in northeastern Kazakhstan, Pavlodar carries an air of grace, weaving together a tapestry of history and modernity. Let's delve into the city's past first. Pavlodar's roots date back to the mid-18th century when it was a fortress town. It quickly grew into an important industrial and cultural hub, playing a pivotal role in shaping modern Kazakhstan. Today, Pavlodar stands tall as a testament to the country's robust growth with its thriving industries and bustling markets. Now, let's shift our focus to the city's unique architectural styles. Pavlodar is a city of contrasts, where classic Soviet-era buildings rub shoulders with modern skyscrapers. Its streets are an open-air museum showcasing a fascinating mix of architectural styles. The city's iconic mosque and cathedral standing side by side paint a picture of cultural harmony that is at the heart of Pavlodar. But what truly makes Pavlodar special is its local traditions. The city is a melting pot of various cultures and this diversity is reflected in its traditions. From traditional Kazakh music and dance to the vibrant festivals, every aspect of city life in Pavlodar is a celebration of its rich cultural heritage. Pavlodar, a fitting finale to our incredible journey. It's a city that perfectly encapsulates the spirit of Kazakhstan, a country that cherishes its past while boldly stepping into the future. As we prepare to depart from Kazakhstan, let's take a moment to reminisce about the journey. From the cultural heartbeat of Almaty, where tradition and modernity intertwine in a beautiful dance, to the futuristic cityscape of Astana, where the skyline resembles a page out of a sci-fi novel, our journey has been nothing short of extraordinary. We traveled to the industrial powerhouse of Karaganda, where we witnessed the sheer might of human determination and ingenuity. We unearthed the hidden gems of Uskomenogorsk, Adirau, and Taraz, where every corner held a new surprise, a new story. Then there was Nur Sultan, the capital city that stood as a testament to the country's rapid progress. And finally, we made our last stop at Pavlodar, a city that beautifully encapsulated the spirit of Kazakhstan, a blend of the old and the new, the traditional and the contemporary. Throughout this journey, we've not only traversed the vast landscapes of this magnificent country, but we've also embarked on an internal voyage of discovery. We've learned about the rich history, diverse culture, and resilient people that make Kazakhstan a unique travel destination. 
We've savored the local cuisine, partaken in their festivities, and formed bonds that transcend geographical boundaries. Every city, every moment, every experience has been a chapter in an unforgettable adventure. This journey through Kazakhstan has not only enriched us with knowledge, but also left us with unforgettable memories.